have the movie here and, and be premiering at, at TIFF? Well, it's always a great pleasure. It's one of the great launching pads for films in the world. And uh, audiences are fabulous here and uh, we hope everybody likes it. Yeah, and they've been very good to Joe over the years, actually, because yeah. Pride and Prejudice and Atonement, so it's very nice to bring this third film here. And as Paul says, it's a wonderful audience. And what was it? This is such a classic novel. What was it about this story that really made you guys want to help bring it to the big screen? Well, that's Tim's, because he started it. Yeah. <laughs> well, we'd all been talking about it for, for a while, actually, to, to try and find a third yeah. historical novel to turn into a movie with the same crew, who'd in, both in front of the camera and behind the camera who'd worked on the previous two movies, and Anna Karenina sort of emerged. And it was really when Tom Stoppard agreed to do the screenplay that the whole thing got a momentum going. And actually, it's been, in terms of length of time to get a film done, this one's been pretty quick, because Tom actually put pen to paper exactly two years ago for the first time. So we were a blank sheet of paper before that. Um, and so the whole thing's happened in, 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 in a nice, contained way. Uh, but it's like, I don't know, it's a big classic love story and, 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 and you know, the, the, the manner in which it's been done for both Paul and I has been an extremely exciting experience because there are, you know, when you, when you, when you go out to make a, a, a historical novel it's too easy to make a sort of frock flick and so this sort of exciting way in which Joe's done it has kept everybody on their toes. Yeah, tell us a little bit about that. I saw the film yesterday. Visually, it's just stunning, but there's so many different elements which he kind of uses to put this all together. What did you think, or, or when he told you about his, his ideas of how he wanted to paint this together, what were your initial re reactions? Well, when he, we were kind of shocked when he is, and kind of perplexed. Uh, and then when we saw the visual presentation, the ideas that were backing up, the thinking, it was so seductive and so exciting. And... Yes, it's, well, the reason we wanted to do it is it's a good old-fashioned romance, a famous book and all that stuff, but this was a novel treatment of it, something that nobody had ever done before, and it felt like a big risk to take and one worth taking. And